For the ClF2 plus Lewis structure, let's count up the electrons. We have seven valence electrons for chlorine, and we have seven for fluorine. We have two fluorines. And the plus sign up here means we've lost an electron. We've lost a negative charge, leaving it positive. So we're going to subtract one, and that'll give us seven plus seven times two is 14. 21 minus one gives us 20 valence electrons for the ClF2 plus Lewis structure. We'll start by putting chlorine at the center of our Lewis structure. It's the least electronegative of the elements here. So we have our chlorine atom, and then we'll put fluorines on either side. Next, we'll place a pair of electrons between each of the atoms to form a chemical bond. So we have 20 total valence electrons. We've used four so far. Now we'll go around and complete the octets on the fluorine atoms. At this point, we've used 16 valence electrons, and we've completed the octet on the fluorine atoms. Next, we'll complete the octet on that central atom there. We have four more valence electrons to use. So we go here, 18, and we've used all 20 valence electrons. In doing so, we've completed the octet on the chlorine as well. So at this point, the Lewis structure is done. This is the Lewis structure for ClF2+, but we do need to do one last thing, and that's put brackets around it and a positive charge to show that it's an ion. And that's the Lewis structure for ClF2+. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.